What's up, everybody? Right now, we're going over pre-workout snack, which is kind of like uh, when, let's say, you get stuck in the office late. You decide last minute that you have to change your workout time. Um, you need to get in the gym and still complete your workout, but you don't want to go starving, but yet you don't have time to, or you're not prepared for a meal. Uh, what should you have on you, or what could you stop and get? So here's the the kind of formula for a snack in a rush when you're running out to the gym. So you were talking about maybe, you know, 20 minutes away. You do not want to have a big meal. You will feel lethargic during your workout. Your blood will be taken to your muscles away from your digestive system. And you're going to be miserable if you have a giant meal on a rush to run out and go to the gym. So now you want to focus on still your, your complex carbs, uh, but not as focused in, uh, on them. Like you can still have room for, let's say a protein bar that does have some sugar in it. Cause you're gonna want that little bit of spike with that little bit of carbs, complex carbs that kind of carry you out throughout the rest. You need something to kind of digest a little quicker in this case. Um, so a protein bar, a Gatorade, uh, a, the Gatorade gummies, uh, or intra-workout BCAAs, or some form of simple sugar to keep your energy going. As for protein, same thing applies with the carbohydrates, uh, whereas you don't want to down two scoops of whey protein and then go squat, because you're gonna come right back up, I guarantee you. Um, you wanna keep the protein, uh, again, I think protein bars are the optimal snack in this case, because you're looking at 20 grams protein, 20 grams carbohydrates, give or take, five grams fat, perfect uh, ratio, for those uh-oh moments where you're running out the door, you're stuck at the office, you got to go straight to the gym, but you need some sustenance. So some more examples uh, that fit that protocol of uh, a little bit of carbs, a little bit of protein, not really that much fat, um, would be one scoop of whey protein in water with a Nature Valley um, granola bar. I used to have those a lot. Um, Again, it's the, the oatmeal, but it also has some of the honey in there for the quick um, insulin response, but then the oats to kind of carry you out through the rest of your workout. Um, your protein bars that aren't the monstrous meal replacement ones, but something like the Optimum Nutrition bars uh, and the, I think, Synthesis 6 Crisp um, is a uh, very good one to have uh, on stock. Um, another bar would be the, the Quest bars, small compact, quick, um, and then uh, if you are uh, in a absolute rush, you really have nothing on you, then look for um, pre-workouts that to always have in your arsenal that have the building blocks to kind of create an optimal workout condition. So for instance, Smoking Guns has the coconut water extract. It has the green uh, coffee extract, things that are really going to pick you up and allow you to kind of transverse the whole workout plane uh, on an empty stomach, but not feeling like you're on an empty stomach. So snack to almost no food. Uh, I think I went over a lot of good scenarios there. Um, and if you, if you just keep in mind the portions I talked about, the carbs I talked about, the protein and the fat, you'll be able to stop at almost any convenience store and find something to fit your your uh, your goal. But be prepared. Go ahead and pick up a box of one of those protein bars I just mentioned, um, the pre-workout I just mentioned, and uh, throw that in your trunk and forget about it. That's your emergency. That's your uh, oh shit moments, if you will. And uh, if you have any other ideas that I might have uh, forgot, leave them below. Share with the community. Let us know what worked for you or a scenario that happened to you and you made it work. And if you like this video, go ahead and like the video. Subscribe to our channel. Anything you want to see me do a video on, product review, workout type, diet type, topic, you name it, leave it below. We'll address it. And as always, thank you for watching.